Blogger.com for beginners. How to use Blogger.com to start writing blogs. Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can use Blogger.com to start your blogging journey. So first off, you're going to go on to Blogger.com and you're going to enter your display name. So whatever name you might want to have. Let's say we are doing Tina's blogs or let's just do it like tina and we're going to continue to blogger and blogger.com is very easy to sign up to all you need to do is create your google account and link it to your blogger account so if you're already logged into google google will automatically create a blogger.com portfolio for you so you can see over here this is the basic dashboard of blogger.com over here you can see different blogs that you create are going to be over here then on the left you have your posts you have statuses you have comments earnings pages layouts themes, settings, and your reading list. So once you have a good idea of how all of these navigations work, you can just click on new blog. So I already have one, so I'm going to create a new blog for you guys. And let's just say we are doing a family blog and you're going to click on next. Then you're going to add the email or domain address for your blog. So it's going to go, uh, let's say if my blog name is family blog. So I'm going to do family blog and now this address isn't available so i'm going to look at a few alternatives and okay so this address is available and it's going to show up as family blog 126.blogspot.com so i'm just going to click on save over here and this is going to be the url for my blog and you can see our website has now been created and you might be wondering i just entered a blog name how has my website been created well if you click on the view website you're going to see that your blog is going to be fully functional there is not a lot you have to set up with blogger they simplify the work for you so you can focus on actually writing your blog so you won't have to waste time with website design and and creating a, a good looking blog website for your blogs you can just get started with just a click and entering your name you want to start posting you can just click on new post over here and you can start adding blogs so on your blog it's very much like the google docs format it has your top toolbar where you can add all of your stuff so first off you're going to add your title then you're going to add whatever text you might want and then you can also add highlight strike through underline text you can also add or insert links over here with text to display so you can hyperlink items as well and then you can also add images and videos so you can just upload them from here now you can also add them from your google drive you can add them from the blogger uploads if you have any images uploaded there or you can even copy images by url so if i look for family photos and I go on Google and I find an image that I like. So let's say I like this image. What I can do is I can just open this image in a new tab. And then I can copy the URL. Go back to my posting site. Then I can click on buy URL. And now I'm going to paste the image URL over here. So I'm just going to switch up the image. I'm going to copy image address. And I'm going to enter it right here. And you can see now our image has been loaded onto my blogger blog and i don't even have to worry about saving images to my computer i can directly upload them via their url and once you have an image uploaded on your blog you can resize it to fit accordingly and then you can move it as well if you want to change up the settings you can click on your image and then you're going to have a drop down box over here and then you can align it differently so if you want to align it to the left to the right to the center if you want it to be medium small or large and then you even have settings like this where you can add text to your image so this is how you create a basic blog and once you have added all of your blog details you can just click on preview to view your blog and then publish it so once you click on publish our blog is going to become published and if i go back onto my website and refresh it you can see over here that my new blog has been added and people can start actually reading my blog so this is how easy it is to get started on the blogger.com platform now you can make as many blogs as you want so you can see i have two right now but i can just click on new blog and enter a new name and start a new blog so you can have different blogs for different purposes and within your blogs you also have stats so you're going to be able to get good basic analytics you can see your all-time views your views today yesterday 
yesterday, this month, and the last month, overall comments and posts, and then you can even see a graphic chart on how many views you're getting. You can see what posts are doing well and what pages are doing well as well. So after that, you have your comment section, and in your comment section, you're going to be able to review all of your comments on all of your different posts. Below that, you have the most important thing, AdSense. Now, AdSense is where Google provides you a uh, account on AdSense, and then you're going to display adverts on your blog. Once you display those adverts, you're going to get a commission. Now, you can create a AdSense account, and if you're doing YouTube already, then you might already have an AdSense account, and you can just link it over here, and you can start making money off of your blogger.com blog as well. Now, after that, you have your pages. So, on blogger.com, you can manage different pages. So let's, this is a one page blog, but if you look at the menu, you can see I don't have anything else, but if I want to create more pages, I can create those as well. And for that, you need to go into the layout section of your website and start editing it. So you can see this is the basic layout of my website. Now I can change this as well. Let's say I don't want this sidebar or maybe I want to add more sections. So I can just click on add gadget and I can add a different gadget. So maybe I want to add some kind of text over here. I can write that text so it could be a welcome text and I can just save that over here like this and that's going to refresh and appear on my website as well. So this is how you customize your website as well. Now you can go into the theme customizer as well to change up the theme. So you can change the background. You can go with the preset ones over here that are available for free on the blogger.com platform. But if you want to choose your own, you can upload your own as well but there are some decent images you can pick from on this platform. So after you have a different image, you're gonna have to change the main color of your blog as well. In the advanced section, you can add different fonts for your colors, you can add your font transparencies, you can edit all of that and add more gadgets over here as well. So once you have all of your changes done, you're gonna make sure to click on save at the bottom right over here. And once you have saved it, you can go back into your basic blog setup. So after that, you have your basic blog setting so you're going to have your title you can change that as well so if you want to change that you can do that if you want to add a description you're going to do that then you're going to add your blog language and make sure you're adding the actual language that you're writing your blogs in because you don't want any discrepancies in the audience that blogger.com targets for your content and there are also warnings that you can add to your blogs if you're posting adult content there's also custom domain linkages that you can create but for that you're going to have to buy your own domain and then you're you might have to buy some premium subscriptions on blogger as well to link a custom domain now you can also set up how many posts you want on your basic blog so if you don't want any blog posts on your welcome page you can change that as well and you can even set that to zero like so and now it's not going to show any blogs on the front page. So this is how easy it is to create a blog on blogger.com. So that was it for today. I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure to like this video and subscribe to the YouTube channel and comment down below the best tips and tricks that I have taught you within this video. And make sure to also share this video with your friends and family and to other creators as well so you can help them out as well. And to anyone that might need to know this basic detailed platform and how you navigate through these different social websites. So I hope this was helpful enough for you and make sure that you do leave a comment down below if I missed out on anything and if there is anything you would like to add and I will catch you guys in the next video.